MBDA successfully conducts first launch of new Tassao MK2E missile for Italian Navy. The recent firing, conducted in collaboration with the Italian Navy, validated the missile's new design elements and confirmed results from wind tunnel tests of its updated aerodynamics. This successful test paves the way for the qualification of the new airframe and propulsion system, set to be completed next year. Equipped with an active electronically scanned antenna AESA RF seeker, the Tiseo MK2E boasts shorter reaction times and advanced mission planning capabilities. It also includes in-flight missile control via a satellite data link, enabling precise engagement of both sea and land targets over long distances. These technological advancements ensure enhanced operational safety for naval crews and the capability to execute deep strikes, neutralizing threats from fixed, mobile, or fortified ground positions. The Tiseo MK2E has been designed to respond to evolving threats and meet modern operational demands. The missile system was developed in close partnership with the Italian Navy and is set to be deployed on the PPA multi-purpose combat ship and new generation destroyers DDX. It will complement the existing MK2A version on FREM and Horizon class vessels and be integrated into future FREM EVO frigates, with potential adaptability for international customers. Highlighting the missile's strategic importance, Giovanni Saccadato, Executive Group Director Sales and Business Development and Managing Director of MBDA Italia, said, This first test of the Tiseo MK2E demonstrates the validity of the project, confirms our development roadmap, and presents a cutting-edge naval defense product capable of countering the most sophisticated threats. It also underlines once again how working in synergy with the customer brings results that perfectly meet their requirements. The decision by our Navy to equip the Tiseo MK2E with the new AESA seeker has made it possible to develop Italian skills in the deep strike domain and will allow our country to participate in the FCASW program in collaboration with France, 